I'm still so wrecked, but when it's like this, you know, you can't complain. It's so beautiful here. It's about 10 to 5 in the morning. I'm just having rice pudding for my breakfast. I've just been and bought some coffee and we're here to do the Surfer Trail 100K. Oh, for God's sake, all three of us here at once. <laughs> Welcome to film my run. It's very early in the morning on a Saturday in July and we're here in Halesmere uh, to run the Serpent Trail 100k. I did it about four years ago. There were a lot fewer people four years ago. There's loads of us now. Uh, so, you know, chances of a top 10 finish are gone. Gone. But there we are. Never mind. We'll see what we do. seven and a half miles into the Serpent Trail 100k. Uh, we've been running for an hour and a quarter, climbed 400 meters of ascent. So we're doing all right at the moment. It's cool, it's overcast, so it should be perfect running conditions really. Right, two hours and 13 minutes into the Serpent Trail 100k. We've climbed just over 700 meters of ascent so far, which is not, not quite half yet of what we're gonna do. And we've done approaching 21k, so about 13 miles done. Beautiful forest that we're going through. Um, uh, yeah, this way. We're following little uh, purple triangle signs that indicate the way and I keep missing them. I've gone the wrong way a couple of times already. So I'm a bit, uh, I'm not so confident on exactly where the route is, although I do have it on my watch. So it shouldn't go too far wrong, really. I've been acting like a wild man Sleeping like a child so luminous and vibrant I'm always in bloom for you Always in bloom, always in bloom for you Serpent Trail 100k So 20 miles is 32 kilometers and uh, we've done that in three and a half hours We're just over three and a half hours now considering that I was thinking maybe 12 hours might be a good time for me to do today. If I continued at this pace, I'd finish in 10 and a half hours and I think that's too fast for me. So I am probably gonna slow down a bit. So many times I've stranded A castaway and I'm now sure Of those stranger in the sky We 
we've done a marathon and uh, we've done that in uh, four hours 50 minutes four hours 50 minutes for a marathon trail marathon that's not too bad is it and um, we're not too far off halfway it's been pouring with rain but that's been good because it's uh, it's helped the heat dissipate a little bit so it's not so hard to run but of course it is now muddier underfoot uh, so that's actually 51 kilometers now done on my watch in uh, five hours 50 minutes we're just coming into Petworth now where the uh, midway aid station is so it may be that I have to do a few more than 100k to finish this race Seven hours and 12 minutes in, 60 kilometers done, which is around about, I guess, 38 miles, something like that. Very tired. And uh, now a few people have started to pass me as well. It's a bit worrying. I'm still running, but I'm just not running as fast as I was. Certainly not running up the hills anymore. So that little experiment has failed. <laughs> Uh, but you know it is what it is we'll get to the end um, so we're looking at anything 12 to 13 hours hopefully now I don't think at the speed I'm going I'm gonna make it in 12 hours I'm always in Right, we're 70 kilometers in, in eight hours, 45 minutes. But that's me done, I am absolutely shattered now. Most of the elevation's done, it's pretty, um, it's pretty flat from here on in, but I've just got no energy in my legs, my back's aching, and uh, I'd like it to be over. We've got, still got 20 miles to go because it's about 102 kilometers. So, still 20 miles. So we're 10 hours and 21 minutes in to the Serpent Trail 100k and I've just hit 80 kilometers. So that's just under 50 miles. And we've got about 22 kilometers left to go, just over 13 miles left to run. Absolutely done in. I think it's to do with um, the South Downs Way 100 recently. I think my legs just aren't recovered enough because my stomach's fine. It's not, it really isn't too hot. It's warm, but it's not overly hot, so I don't think it's that. Right, despite being completely knackered, we still have time to say thank you to all the volunteers. So I've been on the coke today mostly, okay. um, and uh, Marmite sandwiches have been my thing as well today. The sun is out. We're in beautiful countryside and we only have 10, well actually 12k to go. We've just hit 90 kilometers. I'm still so wrecked but 
when it's like this, you know, you can't complain. It's so beautiful here. I'm all right now, I'll just get to the end now. Yeah. Thank you very much for being there though. Yeah, you're welcome. Cheers yeah. guys, thank you. The watch has just hit 100K, 13 hours and 19 minutes for that 100K, but we still have two and a half K to go. Just uh, jogging it along basically, uh, it's about nine minute kilometers. And, uh, yeah, it's still hurting, but I know that we're there now. I know we've got it done, and I know we've got it in under 14 hours. So I'm, uh, I'm relatively pleased with that, given the collapse at 50k. Just going up to the finish now. 100 metres to go. We're going to do it in... Uh, uh, we're gonna do it in 13 hours, 42-ish, 103 kilometers pretty much. But here we go. It's been so nice hearing people beeping their car horns as well, coming through Petersfield. And here we go. Right, I've had a shower. I feel a lot better than when I finished, let me tell you. It's a great atmosphere here. We've got uh, the England European Championship game between uh, England and Ukraine going on uh, up there in the rugby club and it's, it's currently 4-0 to England. We've got runners finishing here uh, and there's bells clanging and people cheering and all sorts of stuff. Really lovely atmosphere. There's food being cooked over here and food and drinks if you want a coffee you can go there or burgers or salad or whatever you want is over there uh, people are sitting down just enjoying the evening and uh, it's been it's been really great the, the run uh, was <laughs> really hard really hard i'm so tired i'm so tired from it but um it, it's a great course if you do get the chance to come uh, and do the serpent trail either the 50k or the 100k if you're interested in the 50k uh, my friend Lloyd from uh, Run for Adventure uh, he's got a video of the 50k today on his channel uh, so go and watch that uh, until the next time uh, we do a crazy ultra and a ridiculous event uh, take care everybody bye bye yeah I finished looking a bit like that as well <laughs> well done <laughs>